You know, I've been running with Allison and competing against Allison for so many years, and she's a veteran. She knows, okay, that was yesterday, it's today, I have two more medals to get. She can be upset after the four by four and the four by one. When she's getting on the plane to come home, that's when you get upset again. Right now, she has to regroup, and she has to get focused, and she has to get ready, and she has to be just as hungry. It reminds me a lot of you in 2012, because I know that that hurt when you lost the 100. But you were so stoic, you had a really good attitude, you came back from that, you break the world record, which is amazing. Did you go to your room and like cry and yell, or those things that we didn't see? <laughs> of course! <laughs> I'm a competitor, I am a competitor. And when I did not win, I was very excited that I did get a medal because I was there for my Aunt Brenda. My Aunt Brenda had passed away from breast cancer, so I wanted all my medals for her. So yes, I was very excited that I got a medal in the first place, but I definitely wanted it to be gold at first. And so, you know, you get a little, ah, but then you're like, wait a minute, I just represented the United States of America. I have a silver medal. Okay, what's next? <laughs> Talk to me about this team. You said veterans and new, I feel like I'm watching a whole crop of new people. I didn't yes. even know their name. And I, and I follow track and field, as you know. What's this team like to you? What, what, do you? what do you like, what are you impressed by when you see? I'm very impressed that there are a lot of younger athletes on the team, but then there are a lot of veterans still. You have Justin Gatlin, 34 years old, just won a silver medal in the 100 meters. That's breaking barriers, letting you know age is not a limit. It doesn't matter, go out there and get the job done. But then we have our younger athletes that are doing very well at the Olympics. I'm sure many people did not think that they would do as well as they're doing. You know, it's a time where changing of the guards is going to happen. And it's happening with Jamaica. You have Elaine Thompson who beat Shelly Ann Fraser Price. They train together and that's also a changing of the guards. Is there any one event that you are most looking forward to coming up now or is that past already? I was very excited to see the men's 400, mm. to see the South African run 4303. Amazing. He almost ran 42 seconds. I don't think people understand that. <laughs> That's so fast. I was very excited to see the 400 meters. I was excited to see the 100 meters and see Usain Bolt do it again three times three gold medals in the 100 meters at the olympics 2008 2012 2016 <laughs> that was very very exciting you know usain bolt is a character he likes to have fun big kid that loves to have fun you would think that he would act a lot different being his status and who he is the fastest man in the world so many medals so many accolades but he is a good time i love being around him he has great personality and he'll come in the room just to make you smile <laughs>